Better Western Mass rolls on now, and we actually brought Karen Randall inside. Came to us this time, and we're talking a staple this time of year, the poinsettia, or poinsettia, Karen. Poinsettia or poinsettia. Tomato, tomato. Um, when I pronounce it on the air, someone always asks me to pronounce it differently. That's not the right pronunciation. So I kind of say it's like tomato, tomato. Yeah, it can't, it gotta be. It's, it's semantics here when we're talking about these. But take a look at some of these poinsettias in front of us right now. The colors, Karen, they really do pop. It's more than just red. It is more than just red. Uh, plant breeders have been developing all kinds of natural colors. Look at that red there, it's a staple. It, it is really a staple is. and it's stunning. You know, there, there's very showy, beautiful, classic red poinsettia. Uh, there, you, you just can't compare, but the plant breeders have come up with all these other beautiful natural colors. This is called marble. This is natural. This is natural. Wow. These are poinsettia. They're little, uh, a smaller, bloom, oh, yeah. uh, little pointy, very cute. They remind me, they're kind of elf-like. I think they should be elf oh, yeah, elves, but, like the ears, but they're yeah. called princetta. This is the best color, I personally, if I, I'm being Okay, biased, well that's wow. marble. That's kind of like this. Yeah. It, it's a nice little marble. Uh, we have uh, like ice crystal and ruby frost that are variations on red. And we this have, one's roses. So. We have jingle bells, yep. We have tapestry that has a variegated leaf, a green and kind of a yellowish leaf, very pretty. And this is, this is winter rose. This is my favorite every year. Uh, it has this curly uh, blossom or mm -hmm. curly leaves, bracts. Uh, it, this is, I think, you can't beat it. No. There's nothing else like it. Let's talk about this new color as well that we're uh, seeing here. Well, this is winter green? We just got this, this is candy winter green. And you know, if you didn't have it next to anything, you'd say, oh, kind of, it's white, but mm -hmm. it's not really. It's definitely a limey kind of green. Yeah, it's neon. It Very pops. pretty. Really, really, really pops. Different. You know, the right decor. Red is not for everybody. No so, about that. And speaking of some colors, you can kind of get creative with it. You shouldn't probably do it at home because you could damage your poinsettia, but take a look at some of these. Well, the, yes. Unbelievable. These are non traditional colors, and we call them fantasy poinsettias. And blue is by far the most popular because there are no Christmas flowers mm -hmm. that are blue, and blue is very popular in a lot of people's home decor. It's their favorite color. So we use a special dye that's developed by the plant breeders, spray white poinsettias for the most part, and then we put um, a plant safe glue, we spray on it, and we dust it with a special glitter. And that's what makes them glitter and glamorous. This was a poinsettia that took kind of a tie dye. It has a couple of colors on it. It has a lavender and a fuchsia on it. And it, it just looks to me like a little snowy fairy style poinsettia. Oh, I just also want to say, all around us, the Better Western Mass Studio, it's really coming together thanks to Karen Randall. She came in here, and this is buffalo plaid that you're putting uh, around Black the and white buffalo plaid, yes. Pretty neat, Karen. It looks so well. Keep an eye out for these on our set. And Karen, thank you very much for stopping by. Tis the season, and this is really a good way to, to stay in that uh, festive spirit that so many people have. Thank you so much for the time. Today. Thank you. We have to give a shout out to Karen. She's always decorating our set for the holidays and we appreciate it. And I love the tie-dye one that she was pointing out. Yeah, we saw that one. I mean, we have them all over the place. And like mm -hmm. she mentioned, mentioned, it's not just red. I mean, we have right. so many different colors throughout the set, especially here yep. on Better. So I grabbed the purple one. Love the purples and the pinks. Mm -hmm. And it'll last through the holidays if you have yeah. those colors. And one thing she did say is even if you get a poinsettia, always want to make sure, even if you're transporting it from mm -hmm. a store to your house, even if it's really quick, you need to have one of these jackets on them. So Can just make it. sure that you keep that in mind if you buy one that doesn't have it already on so that it looks so pretty. And it's a great Christmas gift. All winter gift. long. It is a great Christmas gift and they're pretty easy to care for. I mean, yeah. I have one at home right now and it still looks great. I've had it for almost two weeks and just water it just when it gets water. a little dry. Just check it. And, it and you're good thirsty. to go. And you're good to go. It's for the holidays. Yes. All right.